Well guys, this is it. We're at the final day of the 2023 Lucy. And yeah, we got the semifinals. Um, I actually made it a little bit late, but we're only at game four, but I'm gonna try my best to film as many as many clips as possible. Um, all I gotta say is it has been a fun Lucy and I can't thank you guys enough for watching. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So we're gonna determine who's gonna be in the top eight for the finals. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and let's get it.
Thank <laughs> you. 
cheeky. I'm like, Recapping semifinals with Kyle. I think I need a goatee. No, your goatee looks pretty good. Yeah, I'm not liking but, my beard, but uh, <laughs> yeah, we didn't make the top eight. We kind of struggled as a team, Liz and I. Uh, probably finished like 34th. Not the best week, but a great tournament. And uh, yeah, love everybody here. Love the cause of it all. And uh, we're gonna hang out and watch the finals, like oh. I do every year. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess I'm gonna get a few clips with you before you head off tomorrow. Sounds good, man. Thanks for doing the vlog. It we're was no problem. I bet you had a subscribe, check him out. I bet you had a great time. I did, bro. I really enjoyed it. So, till next time. Peace. All right, guys. Time for the finals. They're now underway. Looking forward to it. We're gonna determine who's the winner, so let's get it.
Hey everybody, quick break here. Um, just want to say a huge thank you to Belmo for appearing in my vlog. Oh, this, mate, this thank you for having me. I hope you guys have really enjoyed his content. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff for more bowling content. But it's been awesome seeing this guy in the back watching us bowl, recording these shots for you guys to see. Um, look, we love what we do, we really do. But you know what makes it even better? Having people like you watch it. So thank you to this guy, thank you to everybody watching. Um, and hopefully you get a chance to come and visit us when we are in a bowling center near you. Till then, be good, peace. And before you go, how did you bowl? I bowled okay, yeah. I, our team um, needed a few more pins. There were a few shots I wish I could have had back because I felt like when I had a really good look, I, I didn't execute a full game. Um, one of the games was really good, I shot 300. But the other ones I, I would have taken, taken a couple of shots back. And, you know, when you're working in a, as a team, if you have it, you've got to make it. You know, and when you're struggling, you try to do the best that you can to get as many pins, but when you have it, you've got to be able to carry the people who don't have it. And so, unfortunately, Sandra couldn't find it today, and I should have done better. I really should have, but yeah, right. live and you learn, right? Yeah, but it was an absolute blast having you, and it, it was truly a dream come true. I mean, I, I mean, like I said, I didn't expect you to come over this year, um, but, it has been a truly a dream weekend. I mean, I appreciate it, man. So. Thank you very much. All right, I'm out of here. Flying back to Australia. Peace. Good, baby. Do it, EJ. Do it! Oh, my God. Do it. Do it.
for nine. Gets it!
one strike away from two three hundreds today. So this is it, Simo for the perfect game for the second 300 of the day. Can he do it? No! Went a little wide.
All right, guys, this is it. We're at the final game. Jello shots. <laughs> um, also, Scott Norton is here. Hello. You guys might have seen him. Um, hundred years ago. <laughs> but our final two are Daniel McEwen and Anthony Simonson and Shannon Plahuski and Tommy Jones. So the final game is underway, and I'm honestly looking forward to it. So hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching.
Well guys, it's over. Danielle McEwen and Simonson are your winners. Yep. Why not? 34 for How about it? That's a winner. That's it. Let's hear it for these great bowlers out here. Our champions, the 23 and 24 Right. Daniel McEwen and Jason Simonson. Right. This makes number one for Anthony. Two for Danielle. She won two years ago. Donna and Carol have some big checks for y'all some awesome trophies. You will also receive some rings, just like everyone else did earlier in the weekend. You'll all be on Facebook. Why do y'all need one? Because we were home. That's not all home. Breast cancer is a great cause. We put some good money towards the, the one I got cancer to research this I'm weekend. Good it's a the battle for anyone with the disease. Ago. And I think these bowlers found out what a battle was this weekend with this lane condition. All right, so that is going to be a wrap for this year's Lucy. Um, all I got to say is um, congrats to Simo and Danielle McEwen. Um, fun fact, they literally started 30th, and they were 250 pins behind the lead. So what a way to come back and win this tournament. Um, it was like the um, PA said that was – Anthony's first Lucy title and Daniel's seventh, um, did I say seventh? Second Lucy title. Um, it must, it must have been a good feeling for Simo to win his first Lucy title and his 13th tour title overall. So huge congrats to them. Um, I was kind of rooting for EJ. Um, he was going for his sixth title this season, but finished third. Um, it is what it is. Um, caught a few bad breaks and yeah. Um, I feel bad for him, but it was a good run for him and Deandra, so hats off to them. Um, hats off to everybody as well. Um, also, hats off to Simo again for going for the second 300 of the day, but just went a little wide off his target and a little fast and left the 2.7, but that's perfectly fine. Um, and also, hats off to Belmo for shooting 300, which is pretty cool. Um, and also, I just want to give a huge shout out, um, one of the bowlers from D-Squad, Wesley Lowe Jr. Um, he actually gave me one of his bowling balls, which is quite surprising. Um, he actually gave me a Motive Supra. You guys might have seen it. Um, it's the green one. It's the new version. Um, I actually took it to the pro shop after Wesley gave it to me. So Mac can change the, um, the layout for me so I can try it out. So I think I'm going to probably record a ball review of the Motive Summit. Um, yeah, that's my first motive ball, and huge thanks to him for giving me that ball. Um, it was honestly unexpected, surprisingly. Um, yeah, I can't wait to try it out in a couple of days. So just want to say huge thank you to everybody who came out to the Lucy this year. Um, mostly th mostly thanks to Donna Connors and Carol Norman Sposha for running a great tournament, as always. Um, yeah, it was amazing. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, yeah, I think that's going to pretty much wrap it up for this year. So just want to say, like I said, huge thank you to everybody who came out. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. And thanks to Belmo for making my day the best, my weekend the best ever. So that's going to wrap it up for this year's Lucy. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget, the full version of the Lucy comes out the 3rd of August, which is this Thursday. So be on the lookout for that. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So that'll be that'll be it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching for this year's Lucy. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, like the video, and we'll see you next time. Peace.